In our health alert tonight, if your child spends too much time in front of a screen, it could be affecting their brain development. Scientists have now revealed a link between screen activity and a child's intelligence. Our chief health editor, Dr. Partha Nandy, joins us now. Dr. Nandy, this is pretty concerning. We know kids love their media, so how does screen time affect them? I don't I know this too well, Heather. So you know I'm a dad and I find this very alarming. I think parents like us really need to pay attention to how our kids are spending their free time. Now in this study, over 4,500 U.S. kids between the ages of 8 and 11 took part and the researchers looked at three guidelines. Are children limiting their screen time, getting enough sleep time and physical activity? And what they found was that children who spent less than two hours in front of screens, who slept nine to 11 hours and did one hour of physical activity, guess what, had the sharpest intellects. They scored higher on thinking, language, and memory tests. And their ability to reason was also much better. So it's great stuff. All right, doctor. So how many of the children actually met those three guidelines? Yeah, that's the question, Alan. So this is what's very shocking. Only 5%, that's right, 5% met all three guidelines and 30% didn't even meet one of them. On average, the researchers found that kids spend 3.6 hours every day in front of the screens. And you guys who are watching, you know about this. And this could be wrecking their ability to focus and stay tuned into completing a simple task. And finally, Dr. Nandy, why are sleep and exercise a part of this study and how does that affect intelligence? That's a great question, Heather. So sleep is a time when the brain grows and also reorganizes memory. I call it sleep is brain food. If you lack sleep, you can suffer from lower alertness and concentration. Exercise can lead to larger brain volume, in particular the areas associated with thinking and memory. So both of these can really help children do well in class and also on tests. And I suggest to parents like myself to limit screen time to two hours or less a day. Make sure kids get between nine to 11 hours of sleep a night and one hour of physical activity per day. I think those will really help. And uh, if you are looking to supercharge your life, please join me uh, this uh, this Sunday at one o'clock on the Dr. Nanny Show where we talk about that as well as tips to really rejuvenate your life. So I hope all of you tune in uh, on, the, on the Dr. Nanny Show at one o'clock on Sunday. I know I will for sure. I need to rejuvenate my life. <laughs> Awesome. Don't we all, right? All right. Thank you, doctor. Really appreciate it.